Mrs. Toombs here. Please excuse the hair. It's really windy today. Um, but I'm actually here on my farm uh, this afternoon. And since we're talking about plants as natural resources, I thought I would show a few of our plants that um, are actually budding and blooming. Um, and we actually use these plants as natural resources because we eat them. Let me show you what I'm talking about. This is one of our pear trees that we have here on the farm. Um, and when this tree was in bloom, it had really pretty white flowers and white with white petals. And when they fell, when the petals fell off, we actually get the fruit part, which is the pear. And it looks something kind of like this. When the petals fell off, I have a few more down here for you to look at. And these will get bigger um, and start to hang off of the tree and make and it will become a pear um, when it's bigger. Um, we can actually pick it, eat it, cook it, uh, whatever. So this for that. is just one of our peach th trees. We actually have three of them. Two, three. Um, and earlier this year, it had beautiful red flowers. And from those flowers, those petals fell off and then these little buds came on. This is actually a peach. If you look closely, you can see it's um, fuzz right on there. Get the tree to stop moving. There we go. You can see the fuzz right on there. I have a few more on here. There's one right there. There's one up here. Don't worry, that is actually not a spider on it. It's actually part of the petals that fell off right there. So that's pretty interesting. And there's another one right here. All right, so this is one of our apple trees. We have six here on the farm. This is a pink lady tree. So when um, the apples start coming in on this tree, they will actually be pink lady apples. You probably have seen some of them in the store. You can see on this tree, the flowers, the buds, the buds for the flowers they actually start off this beautiful pink like magenta color and then they turn into the white flower each of these flowers these blooms not all of them actually will turn into a apple it has to be pollinated in order to turn into an apple um, and if it's not pollinated then it will just stay a flower and then the flowers will fall off and it'll just look kind of like this and then eventually those will fall off and it'll be nothing but leaves but the ones that are pollinated like by the bees or actually there are some trees that are pollinated by flies very interesting right um, those will actually turn to fruit and you can see there was no really uh, fruit on the apples just yet. Apples don't usually start coming in until fall. 